My first job that I had a paycheck from somebody, uh, I worked at Bush Gardens, the Congo River Rapids, which is one of the rides. So I was like, hi, did you enjoy the Congo River Rapids? Would you like a towel? I knew that I never wanted to work selling towels at Bush Gardens. And I knew that I wanted to go to college. Don't wait until it's too late to learn that lesson. That's why jobs when you're teenagers are so important. I work at Hell Reservation with um, about, I'd say, 10 to 15 kids at the most. So we watch over like their activities that they do at this camp, which include like swimming. They do rope courses for the older kids. I work in the communications department here at the Red Cross. and. Um, I do a lot of social media. Every day when I come in, I go to my desk and I start working with my peers. We're making a puppet show to teach little kids fire safety, what to do when fire happens, or how to be prepared, or how to prevent fire from happening. I supervise um, four people. Um, we go out into like low-income neighborhoods um, and try to fix up people's bikes. I am making a video with my group, and the video that we are making is a day in a life of an art science student. A lot of our studies, unfortunately, revealed some bad news over the recent years, where you know the teen employment rate has fallen to historic lows. Going, all, you know, we have a data series going all the way back to 1948, and in no time in that history uh, uh, have teens worked uh, less than they have over the last few years. And there's a whole lost generation of people. Uh, because they're not getting any job skills. They're now 22, 23, they haven't had a job for four or five years. What are they gonna do? At this job, I'm learning skills such as editing, taking pictures, and the functions on the camera and how to set up a camera. I'm learning communication skills, kind of coping with like different children, um, different age groups. Public speaking skill, and also just um, working with mechanics. How to reach out to the media more about the company. If I don't have enough staff, our camp would not be able to operate. So I definitely depend on my junior counselors for this camp to operate. It helps us learn better about how today's young people interact and what we need to do to engage those young people. We don't invest in, in youth by and large. We don't listen to them. Um, we don't give them a chance to express their opinions um, openly in, in our society. And we don't really place a high value on them in general. Having a job as a teen is important because you learn different skills that you wouldn't learn if you were just home playing around. It also supports you. Um, the money that I use, it also uh, support the family as well. Society benefits because you have, when you have more teens working, you have uh, there, there's spending multipliers because teens go out and, and spend their money in, in the local economy. Um, there's also the benefits that their teens build their work experience. I wouldn't know how important working it is and how important school is. Having all the jobs that I've had has like shown me what I want to do in life. Being in that professional environment and that setting is extremely important. Those are skills that, uh, that are not taught in school. We need to make sure young people are gainfully employed in professions that, with opportunities that will allow them to be successful, that prepare them to be successful because their success is our success.